and uh, he just listened to a young girl who was saying that the Nigerian community here is totally very angry. So be very interested in this point at all. There's something that needs to be avoided. Some meaning for us. Some are empty. With too much meaning and riches to offer humankind. You know, after some of these deadly adventures and more, one can still find footprints of these big lives on the pavements of our contemporary lives. Good evening. You're welcome to the program Green Planet. Good day, thank you very much and welcome to People, Places and Events and to the African Center for Community and Development. What is your name? Okay, and today you are celebrating Women's Day in Libya. What do you think are the problems women face? Women face a lot of problems of jobs. There are a lot of Enterprises or companies that don't take women because they say soon they will have, they will deliver, they will be sick. So we have a lot of problems of the jobs in India. And come on. And today you're celebrating Women's Day. What are you going to do? What are your activities today? The activities we are marching, we are dancing, we make parade. Ballet, that we do a lot of things because we are so happy we dance. We will eat a lot the women, we will eat and drink a lot. Okay, what is the message you are trying to pass? And what would you like men to understand about women? Men should understand that a woman is not a slave to a man. Women have their own rights in the society. We, they should know that women are the backbone of the whole world. And women are, let's say, helpers to men. They should not take them like slaves. They should take them as their partners. Let's say their brother, their sister. They should take them like real partners and not slaves. Thank you My group is uh, from uh, Zian Division, Baba Kabali. And you are celebrating Women's Day in Cameroon? Yes, we are, we are celebrating Women's Day in Cameroon. What are the problems women face? We have so many problems, we cannot say it now. Yes. Okay. Like what? Like uh, we have problems, children, we have farming, so many problems. Yes. Children are worrying us nowadays, being young ladies. So we have so many problems. And today what do you intend to tell your, your, your men brothers? We have to, we want to tell them that uh, they should help us. 
the men will help us to bring up the children so that they will behave in a nice way that they will grow up and go so, so far for education. That's it. Thank you very much for talking to people places. Thank you very much. It's a non-governmental organization which work is to empower women, particularly the rural women, because society, particularly in Africa, the rural population constitutes the larger, larger, larger population, and educating the girl child, sensitizing the women against HIV AIDS, empower them, and also training them on improving agricultural techniques to help to boost the food, thereby curbing hunger and elevating poverty among the population. Particularly the civil society organization has been doing much through seminars and workshops, forums where women have been sensitized to improve. What message do you want to tell the men folks as um, a way of letting them to, to create more holistic instruments for the government in Cameroon and Africa? Well, I will encourage and encourage the government particularly to set as they say, they will put up a, an agricultural bank that will give credits where women can take loans in long term and use it to improve on their livelihoods, particularly the rural communities. Thank you very much for watching. Thank you very much. And uh, you just listen to a young girl who was saying that the Nigerian community here is totally very angry. So be very interested in this point at more than so.